Hey there, car enthusiasts and concerned drivers. Today, we're diving into a crucial component of your vehicle that you might not think about often. But boy, it can cause a world of trouble when it goes wrong. I'm talking about the Engine Coolant Temperature Sensor, or ECT sensor for short. Imagine you're on a road trip, miles from the nearest town, and suddenly your car starts acting up. The engine's overheating, you're burning through fuel like crazy, and black smoke is billowing from your exhaust. Sounds like a nightmare, right? Well, all of these could be symptoms of a failing ECT sensor. But don't worry, I'm here to arm you with knowledge. In the next few minutes, I'll break down the nine telltale signs that your ECT sensor might be on the fritz. So buckle up and let's get into it. First things first, what exactly is an ECT sensor? It's a small but mighty component that sits in your engine with its tip submerged in the coolant. Its job, to measure the temperature of your engine coolant and report back to your car's computer. This little gadget is crucial for keeping your engine running smoothly and efficiently. Now, let's dive into those nine symptoms. Number one, check engine light. This one's pretty straightforward. If your ECT sensor is acting up, your car's computer will likely trigger the check engine light. But here's a pro tip. Look out for specific error codes like PR128, PR115, PR116, PR117, or PR118. These are all related to ECT sensor issues. Number two, increased fuel consumption. Notice your car's suddenly turned into a gas guzzler? A faulty ECT sensor might be telling your car's computer that the engine's cold when it's not, causing it to pump in extra fuel unnecessarily. Number three, radiator fan issues. Your ECT sensor could be the culprit if your radiator fan isn't kicking in when it should. It might not be signaling when the engine needs cooling, leading to potential overheating. Number four, black exhaust smoke. Seeing a trail of black smoke in your rear view mirror? This could mean your engine's burning too much fuel, often due to incorrect temperature readings from a faulty ECT sensor. Number five, engine overheating. This is a biggie, folks. If your ECT sensor isn't accurately reporting engine temperature, your cooling system won't kick in properly, potentially leading to severe engine damage. Number six, hard starting. Have trouble getting your car to turn over in the morning? A bad ECT sensor can mess with your engine's fuel mixture, making it harder to start, especially when cold. Number seven, poor idling. If your car's shaking like a leaf when you're stopped at a light, your ECT sensor might be to blame. It could be causing your engine to receive the wrong fuel mixture. Number eight, engine misfiring. Feel like your car's hiccuping while you drive? That could be engine misfiring, another potential sign of ECT sensor trouble. Number nine, bad engine performance. Last but not least, if your car's not responding well to the gas pedal or generally performing poorly, a faulty ECT sensor could be the reason. Now, I know what you're thinking. These symptoms could be caused by a lot of different issues. And you're right. That's why it's crucial to get your car checked by a professional if you're experiencing any of these problems. But here's the good news. ECT sensors are relatively inexpensive and usually pretty easy to replace. So if you do find out it's your culprit, it won't break the bank to fix. There you have it, folks the nine symptoms of a bad engine coolant temperature sensor. Remember, your car is a complex machine and paying attention to these warning signs can save you from bigger, more expensive problems down the road. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more car care tips and tricks. And hey, share this video with your friends. You never know who might need this information. Until next time, keep your engines cool and your drive smooth. See you on the road.